So I have, oops, sorry. I have two pieces. One is a mindset, and the other one is a skill set. So the mindset that I think really helped me move to, into leadership was going from me to we. Okay, you may have heard this before. When I was focused on me in the early days, before I knew any better, I was really excited because of my story. I really thought I had a lot of experience in business, so I kind of just brought all of my stuff into Take Shape Life and actually convoluted it. But what happens when somebody's focused on me, who are they focused on? Themselves, right? And the self is really right just down the ego. How many of you think when somebody's in their ego, you can tell? Is that person coachable or less coachable? Less coachable. When somebody's in their ego, are they more attractive or less attractive? When somebody's in their ego, they're thinking about themselves and they're probably in a competitive mindset, true or false? And when somebody's in a competitive mindset, that leads to winning and losing, yes or no? Yes. Does that build cooperation? No. Does that build teamwork? No. So there's another way to play this, and that's called going to we. When you're focused on we, you're focused on who? Others. You're focused on team. This is the key, this is the bridge into being a team builder, from moving from me to we. Now, once you start focusing on team, what happens is instead of being uh, uncoachable, you become more what? Uncoachable. Instead of being competitive, you become what? Cooperative. Cooperative. When you become cooperative, then other people start seeing that and they start doing that, and next thing you know, just like ego breeds ego, sharing breeds sharing. Write this down. Sharing is having more. You ever heard the concept of synergy? What does it mean? The formal definition of when the sum of the whole is greater than the sum of the individual parts. In other words, one plus one doesn't equal two, one plus one equals three, magically. And that only happens when you're in cooperation. Does that make sense? Because when you're still two individuals competing for who's better, or who's winning, or who's getting the limelight, or who's, this is my team, this is my training, this is my way of doing it. Guess what? Not only do you lose out because you're du creating duplication of dysfunction, you're also losing out because you're not in an open mind for learning. And guess what? The we, the big team, they miss out too because we can all learn from each other. Sharing is having more. If you learn something that works and you share it with me, we all win. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yes. So the biggest thing is move from me to we and then watch your team grow.